Welcome, welcome everyone, Ragnarok here with part number 21 of our Warhammer 3 Immortal Empires Bretonia campaign as Luan Leon Kerr. Alright, so previously we picked up the Sword of Caron and we wiped out uh, Marathi's army here that was threatening us here. But I, um, one of the Bray Herds just popped up here, which... Um, Probably is best for us to fall back and deal with that, which is kind of annoying because uh, we're moving towards. Um, where's Lewin? Champion of the lady. Uh, Lewin can't even reach reach him this turn. We're almost back to full strength next turn. Do you know who I am? Ah, uh, Karako. This is annoying. Glory. All right, how do we get the uh, camera? All right. All right. Um, pop the green knight in his army as well. And then what I want... Very well. Is these two artillery pieces in there? King Lewin. And you guys might as well come back and we'll try and get some experience for them as well. See if we can fight it out with this dude. Um, this guy's here to guard. Um, just put him into. All right, these guys all leveled up. Yes. Holy shit. Efficiency. Um, this guy, what's uh? Pictures expects where ah, uh, hag butcher. Your defense action cost minus yourself. What the hell? That that's seriously the uh here was in local province. Wow. Wow, that's that's what you get for defeating Guardian. Defeating Marathi? It's only the main army that gets it, I guess. Alright, so let's yes. um scale this down a little bit. Noble. We don't need all of these armies here. Bias. And I think, based on how things look here, Refused. a Norskan army up there. Hmm. Valiant Lord. Oops. Norskan yes. army out there that could cover the distance in in a turn or two. So let's. Let's just merge these up. How many do you have here? Very well, if you insist. My reputation precedes me. Let's leave it at that uh, for the time no. being, and let's have you recruit a uh, few. So that how we have a standing. Though actually, no. He doesn't need to recruit them. We've got um, we've got a pretty significant standing army here. Um, but we're not making very much money. And not to mention, uh, Lewin is nearby. If anything, we could recruit a couple more down here. But we'll wait and see what they do. Let's get this built. Um, Protector of the realm. How many can we recruit in a turn? We can recruit five in a turn. And how is the garrison? The garrison should replenish. Blessings of the lady mm. be upon you. I would say it'd be three turns before they get here because, well, possibly they get here in two turns. My reputation precedes me. Let's just grab two. Um. Blessings right. of the lady be upon you. 
All right, I think we're looking good. Um, yeah, it's a little annoying that we're falling back from attacking there. But yeah, I'd like to keep this. I don't know. I mean, this probably wouldn't be able to take this. Well, I don't know. The Minotaurs. The, Min the Minotaurs and Saigors, man. You don't want to underestimate those. Don't want to est underestimate them. We want to upgrade this. Air capacity plus one for damsels. Where is our uh, of the lady. our scout? Yeah, I don't think she needs to be here. Really, don't need her. Um, though she's got um, her trade is good. Uh, ambush success chance plus ten percent for allies in you the region. Wound, uh, not very good. Field technology. Oh, uh, might as well. Why not? Get our technology it's moving a little bit faster. Oh, failure. All right, yeah. Um, fuck, I always hit that. I mean to, yeah, mop this up. Probably use auto resolve for that because. Auto resolve will wipe the army out completely so we don't have to run it down. Just hopefully they don't move somewhere where it's gonna we're gonna be further from where we were headed initially. What is Avalorn up to? What are they doing out there to see? Yeah, I, I mean, the the AI does some things that you're like, okay, like the AI definitely seems to know what it's going on, uh, what it's doing. Like, you know, when it when it shows the um, bias towards the uh, the player, the anti-player bias, um, it definitely seems like the AI knows knows exactly what it's doing. But other times, you watch the AI, especially with your allies and stuff, and it's like, what on earth is the AI doing? But I mean, when you think, when you step back and look at the game as a whole, and the um, oh, nice, very nice, Rathi's getting her ass handed to her. Yeah, when you step back and look at the game as a whole, and the um, where is Ikit Claw headed? And how how it functions, everything functions together. I mean, it's immensely complex. And it's it's pretty pretty incredible to see how the whole thing functions. Um, all these different um, different factions with such unique mechanics. A lot of them. Um, it is really impressive what they've uh, what they've put together here. Get claw on the move. Where is he headed? He's headed. It looks like he's headed north. Yeah, and now Kemler is recruiting more troops. Though it looked like those armies had some junk in it. I don't know. I don't know what he's got access to in his. He must have at this stage of game, must have access to some pretty decent troops. We're just chilling out. They look like they're building up their forces, the Van Heimlings and Bellacor there. They if they do that, they could have potentially a pretty big force to send against us. Is that? 
I, I sort of zoned out there for a second, but what's that? Yes, he looks like they are headed down towards us. Carlos Red Eye. We might have to um, recruit some more lords again. That, um, yeah, that could be problematic. I think we'll probably put the defenses in. Um, tempting to put the Grail Shrine in because the Grail Shrine will give us um, unit of Grail Knights as defense. All right, good. At least he's moving in the uh, the right direction. rid of North uh, Marathi and now we've got to deal with the Norskins. Oh. Oh. Why is eight? Ten turns. A treasonous peasant was discovered siphoning extra grain for himself and family who are apparently starving. Clerics say we should make an example of him. What do you think? Have him hanged? Show leniency. I feel like these are showing leniency. I, you know, ah, fuck, man. These are both terrible. What a. Can I just skip this? I don't want this. I wonder what happens if I load. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, sorry to do this to you guys. It's just going to take a second to load. But I... I don't know. Maybe maybe it won't make a difference. But I have a sneaky feeling that maybe the event message won't pop up here if we reload it. Chaos is anathema to harmony, and so we must fight it with every measure of your flesh and soul. You shall give your lives willingly if required. But the Dragon Emperor and the Moon Empress must preserve and ensure that harmony is kept in balance. The Kree of Yuan Bo, the Jade Dragon, Master of the Meteor Winds. All right, let's see here. What do we, what do we got? What do we got? I mean, you might not be able to. Uh, this is one of the one of the things you you can't really do. If yep, see, it got rid of it. <laughs> Uh, world defense, no message. Yeah, it's one of the things you can't do when you're playing on. Though, this guy is not moved. Oh, shit, is this... Are we at the end of the turn here? Oh, for sh... You gotta be shitting me. It didn't, uh... We gotta go through the end turn again. We gotta go through the end turn again. Well, since we know... Ah, damn it. Sorry, guys. Sorry about that. Uh, my apologies. Alright. Well, maybe it won't... Maybe the, the message won't come up. I thought it would... Start as... I guess it uh, the, the save hadn't come in. Well, Shiza. Um, anyway, fingers crossed we won't get the message. I think the... the or the event. Um... The event, I think, is a random thing, unless it's um, unless it's hard coded to happen. Be interesting to see if they make the exact same moves as they as as previously. Though I can't can't remember all of their moves. I'd have to go back and check the tape. Yeah, anyway, in my defense, I thought it would um, we w it would just reload the game at the beginning of the turn. That we wouldn't be... Yeah, look at that. Marathi doing the same thing. Attacked there and destroyed. wonder if the elves will invade. It gets headed north. Seems like they're doing pretty much the exact same stuff.
Where is Reichland headed? Look at this. There's an Aquitaine army up there as well in Norskan territory. Rome is going to be tough for us to take on. We might, might want to build up Lewin's army a little bit more, though our strength in relation to the Barrel Legion is pretty good. Thinking that at once we take the Blackstone Post, then maybe we'll Blackstone Post and the other settlements um, recruit some more peasants for uh, for Lewin's armies. I uh, wouldn't mind having some more some more Grail Knights in Lewin's army, but I, cash is kind of a little bit tight for that. We've got to be careful. We need to keep enough cash on reserve to defend our um, our settlements when they come under attack, which seems to be um, the AI is primed to attack. Get out of here. Yeah, that is the Fey Enchantress over there in the middle of nowhere. Is she going for Skaven Blight? Make it Claws heading heading north. I don't think um I don't think she can take Skaven Blight. To be honest, it's a really really tough um yeah, this is that that looks like it's gonna be a tough army to deal with. Damn it, and I used up my um regiments of renown already. Maybe we maybe I disbanded them too soon. Neighbors in the east to deign to. No, they're almost wiped out of the game anyway. Redhorn tribe. You can run. Alright, we're almost to the end of this end turn. Sorry about that, guys. I didn't... But... On the bright side... We can get that thing. That thing would have been devastating, especially to a fight down here. Why the fuck is this guy not getting replenishment? Very well, if you insist. There we go, he's getting replenishment now. Alright, let's keep another general here. How long for these guys? Four turns, two turns, four turns. What do we got? Speed, bonus versus large, but bonus you versus know large. Who I am. And let's uh, go full on. Uh, does this guy, did he make it to the Knight's Vow? He needs one more level up. One more level up. Um, which means he could potentially, could potentially grab these two. We're at 20 out of 20. We're going to be, ah oh man, this is going to crush our income. These guys. Blessings of the lady be upon you. My strength yeah. and wisdom are yours. 13. How is the um, replenishing slowly? Are they gonna be? Fuck, I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna be strong enough to take that on. What are we? Uh, we don't know what we're up against. We've got a death sorcerer that we know of. My reputation precedes me. Noble. Well. Do you know who I am? Do what we did. We'll do it. Do it the best we can. So. We could use a little bit of cash. 
We'll get some money for by the light of the lady. Or damsels leveling up. Um actually maybe life bloom. Alright. My reputation. Are they gonna stand in is he gonna stand and fight? If the lady wills it. Very well, if you insist. I will indulge you. The lady wills it! Yep. Clear war. For glory! Oh, they are gonna stand and fight. Um, 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 really could f resolve this. How what's in the range on these guys? Four hundred or forty. We'll fight it. Um, auto resolving would wipe them out completely. Um, but we don't necessarily want to do that here because they should um, they should back off in the direction that we want to go. And we should be able to um, to run them down um, and get a little bit of extra experience for our um, our lords. Yeah, so I mean, a few minotaurs here could be problematic, and the um, Sigors could be problematic as well. Aside from that, there's nothing too, um, too scary. King Lu and Leo Kerr. We serve the king. Peasant bowmen. All right, are you still on foot? Yeah. All right, you stay put there. Um, ba -ba -boom. keep uh, couple of these guys in behind, and what do you beat? Let's maybe go through the woods and see if we can get around. Um, I'm not sure. King Lu and Leo Kerr. My gifts are yours. Rail knights. Peasant bowmen. It's all on guard mode. All right, let's uh, see how this goes. Take the ground. Go through the forests. Very well. I want to try and get to those Cygors. To my banner. The. So if they're gonna throw throw rocks at um at these guys, we could just um let them waste their ammo. King Lu and Leo Kerr. Oh, this is not we can't see their full King army Lewin, Leo here. Kerr. King Lewin, riding out! Are oh, they gonna turn her? Oh, he's gonna turn around and shoot at our knights here. I guess kind of committed to this. King of Bretonia, swiftly. Green knight. So I don't, I don't want to get in there and get involved with all those minotaurs necessarily. I shall prevail. To the sweet. The lady's chosen. Wise indeed. Champion of the lady. Alright, see how Lewin does there. You guys, stay away from there. And you guys, get around and charge at that Cygor. They go the Cygors first. Did our reinforcements come on the field yet? Not yet, they're almost here. Alright, so we've got Minotaurs. Should be okay here. And is Lewin winning? Lewin's so he just got charged from behind. We are ready. All right, pull out of there. Moving up base. Battle ready. I don't know about my my strategy here. Oh, 
those guys on Pegasus could be helpful. Ah, oh, shit, I don't have you guys. You guys bombing this? You guys should be bombing this, and... We need to get up here. And back here in behind, how are we doing? Shit. Got out of there, but I, I want to fight those guys all at once. Lewin, how are you doing? He seems to be doing okay on his own. These guys are doing alright. Get you up here. You guys take out those. Um, come over here and attack this. Yes. Probably take those. Those on. Got a little heal here. Alright, get the ch little bit of a charge bonus here, see if we take out these Minotaurs. Fight for uh, the honor. one unit that's damaged. Let's pull you out. Be How are you doing? doing Alright. Things seem to be going okay here. You guys pull back. Luan is handling himself all right. Taking a little bit of damage, but uh, Your command. Swiftly. Attack. where are my archers? Let's get the uh, the archers up here. Oh, we've got Quickly. Grant me your wisdom. Slay them. Doing okay. This guy, right? Cut them down. To victory. You get in there too. I think, uh, I think the army lost. Kicking in. Kicking in. Yeah, we didn't even get these guys into the fight. All right, let's uh, come over here and get healed a little bit. Don't need to be healed. Peasant Peasants, see if we can finish off Two a few more. of them. King Luan Leoncar, protector of Bretonia. Yeah, Luan didn't take too much. Time. Luan is a real tank, man. He's one of the. Uh, he's a really powerful lord. I am your man. At speed, quickly now. Damsel. We'll just fast forward a little bit. Doesn't seem to be helping this guy. Ah, damn it, we're out of magic. Out of winds. Not too much damage, a little bit, on our Grail Knights. Just wondering if the follow-up battle, if we should actually fight it, so that we can heal up, and we can make sure that these guys don't take any more damage. Or if we should auto-resolve it just to, uh, I mean the auto-resolve should be pretty, pretty surgical. It's going to take us a couple turns to get to Kemmler's, um, Kemmler's territory anyway, so should get most of this healed up in the meantime. Shit, we are really getting close to 4,000 chivalry. That's not good. You seek the lady's favor. All right, well... My blade is ready. Yeah, let's let's finish him off. My strength and wisdom are yours. 
Protector of the realm. Taking my leave, I will not blight my soul. Blessings of the lady be upon you. Going forth. I am the blood of Gilles. Alright, yeah, auto resolve should suffice here. And yeah, the archers are really kind of out of place in the army. I mean, trebuchet for that matter as well. Alright, good, good. Round of command. Alright, guys, that is going to be it for today's episode. We're free to move on to Kemler's uh, to take him on. I think we've got a sufficiently strong force here. Um, I gotta, man, we gotta do something about the chivalry. We're, I'm, maybe, maybe switch it back to the heraldry of Aquitaine and do the, um, do, um, if the lady wills it. do the confederation. Sorry, guys, my brain. <laughs> My brain just stalled out for a minute there. Um, yeah, do the confederation because we're not ready. We've only got you know who I am? one, Champion of the lady. Uh, two, My reputation precedes me. three. We've only got three knights with the um, with the knight's vow. Um, this guy's close. Yeah, we've only got three, which means that only potential potential of three armies with um uh, actually let me just double check if we've got anybody else yeah no that's it i think we lost somebody at one point that was um yeah somebody over here something that was uh that Not was pretty chance. close these assholes are no. recruiting god if they come at the same time that's gonna be bad it'll be really bad no. carlos red eye <laughs> carlos the norskin um, anyway, guys, I'm just sort of thinking out loud because we want as many, we want to have as many knights recruited, or as many generals recruited as possible we'll with the knights' vow the when we hit 4,000, because that will um, that will give us free free knights, um, free knights upkeep uh, potentially for all of those guys. And if we've only got three, um, that means only three armies that we can get with the free knights. So, um, yeah. Anyway. I am uh, starting to ramble. We got lots of uh, look, lots of work to do still in this campaign. We still haven't, um, you know, a couple minor detours. Have yourselves a great day, guys. I will see you all next time. Ragnarok signing out.